black crosses, black crosses, black black crosses, crosses, black crosses, team nauseous, team nauseous. Okay, so chat, what's good with y'all? Alright, this is Vibe Out. Y'all know y'all know the King Hearts streams, so we're gonna play King Hearts on our stream, just talk amongst ourselves and stuff. No toxicity, no stress, just chilling. Oh, by the way. Y'all y'all enjoy Finance and Freddy's chat? Y'all enjoy how, how annoying that game is? Yeah, that game is pretty annoying. Huh. 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 this? Oh, you got it. That's good. You got it. But, uh... An amazing clip. Oh, really. You know how I love amazing clips, right? Is that really? Is that really? Oh, I think last time I like lost something. Um, so chat, chat, what y'all, what y'all, what y'all want to discuss? Like, just bring up, bring up a random topic. I, I, I have one, but let's see, y'all have any other topics to talk about. about monkeys lamps why lamps and the anime is zero special secret sword he has in his pants i have identified the scent what it is riku riku you Warfords. say has he emerged from the realm of Best darkness his existence it was once doubled in the darkness Fascinating. That's why you mistook him for the superior. The dark power given to Riku facilitated his escape from its realm. It's almost bring up like music. Dre, please don't bring up music. Why he appeared here in Castle Oblivion? I'm sorry. That's really quite After yesterday, his existence resonates with that of another hero. Sora is in the castle. He arrived earlier. Chess got made future. I'm like, huh? <laughs> Without even bothering what the to fuck? consult us. Hello? It seems he desperately wants the Keyblade Master for himself. What a foolish plan indeed. Sora's is not such an interesting existence. That the entity great, that dude. holds true. Or basically, he, he basically said that. Is Riku the hero of Dark? He basically said that. Or he said, or basically he said that Travis Scott made New Age Future with the auto tune and everything. Well, I'm like, that's definitely cat, because Future been doing auto tune for a long ass time before Travis Scott came into the picture. But we gonna get to that. <laughs> Edgar Allan Poe. Why? Why we're talking about Edgar Allan Poe? Why that? I actually, I have, a, look, I have a better question. Let me see. Okay, look. I was thinking, okay, I was driving to work this morning. And I was like thinking about this. So I was like, you know, this would be a good question to ask, Jack. So, Chat. Okay. Quick, quick. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I was. Y'all yeah, yeah, know about Tupac and Biggie, obviously. You know, here and there. Okay. I have a question. Who do you think would prevail more in, um... Well, okay, who do you think would prevail more in modern age hip-hop? You know what I mean? Do you think Tupac would prevail more or Biggie would prevail more in modern age hip-hop? Like, in today's day and age. Let's say, let's say they're both still alive, they didn't die, and like, you know... Let's say they're all... They're all just, they're still making music with Biggie and shit. Darkness! Yeah. Hey, what? I think I honestly I, I think Biggie would prevail more over Tupac. <laughs> That's just me. Edgar Allan Poe is a pedophile. He's married. He's a married cousin. I mean, shit. To be honest, I'm not surprised about that. I mean, he he wrote some pretty you know, dark ass stories. So. <laughs> Huh. 
Take this. Yeah, Biggie. I think Biggie has some shits for me. Like it. Biggie for sure got some shits. Oh my god, oh my god. Your Majesty. Time's up. Bro. Except bro, something about Biggie and his flow. Ah, bro, I, bro, I enjoy Biggie very much, bro. That nigga has like, crazy flow. Time's up. That's one thing I fuck with him about. Darkness. Yeah. Yeah. Better than Pot. I feel like as a rapper, Biggie is better than Tupac. I do agree with that. As a rapper, but as like a songwriter, as a songwriter, Tupac does, has those no two. Tupac is a better songwriter, in my opinion. Or I would say just songwriter, but like song song maker. I thought in terms of like creating music, like you know, music off of shit, like or, or his lyrics, like the lyrics for uh, like, his music and shit. Um, Tupac has, Tupac has. But as like a rapper, for you perform on, like I think Tupac. Yeah. Like, I'm saying, I'm saying. Biggie? I don't remember right now. Fuck was way better than Biggie. I ain't gonna argue about it with that. We should be like, I don't know what I'm It depends what we're talking about, though. Like, uh, real note, bro. Like, everything is real. Like, Biggie for sure got rap Tupac. Like, no, no question. Biggie got rap And y'all, and y'all use the example of, uh, you know, hit him up freestyle. The only, the only highlight, the main highlight of that song was literally that he fucked his bitch. Yeah. Like, that's all it is. Take this. <laughs> oh, or fuck, I don't even fuck his wife. Outside of that, though, I, I feel like Biggie could like, hit him with like stronger punchlines and shit. And like I said, who shot ya? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> that shit's disrespectful. Who shot ya? Take this! That's, that's so disrespectful. Yeah. Ha, like it. <laughs> Darkness. All right. So okay. So I want this question. Yeah. All right. So all right. With okay. With Ken. Okay. With Kendrick Lamar and yeah. and J Cole. I thought like, I thought like I know y'all's answer. To this Who do y'all think would prevail more in uh? Let's see. What am I looking for? And old age hip hop, like you know, old age hip hop. Let's say their music was still the same music in this age, or they played back in the old, in the old days. Who would prevail? Who would prevail more? Like it. Take this, Kendrick. Hmm. Your Majesty. Ah, time's up. Hmm. Very, very hmm. that's, that's hard to say. I don't know. I got. I don't know. I'm, I'm like, it's a split decision. I don't really know who. I mean, Kendrick, Kendrick music was crazy. Kendrick music at the time was for real. But shit, I don't know. What's the question? The question is, who would, who would? All right, as an artist, who would prevail more? As like a, um, who would prevail more in like, a, like. Old age hip hop, like you know, the nineties, you know, all that time, you know, back then. You know what I mean? Or I would say the, gold, the golden age of hip hop, the golden age of hip hop. Jay Cole be the legend, but Kendrick would make him more legendary. I feel like. Let me see. Okay, look. I feel like J Cole. Yeah, I don't know. It's hard to say because. All right, cause look at here. Back then, because of Kendrick, all right, he puts he puts a soul in music, which is good, which is honestly really good. But also, well, that both the both put their songs in music. I don't know, bro. It's hard to say. Like, I don't know. I feel like Kendrick he definitely uh, does a lot of uh, you know, different stuff. Like, like he puts like a lot of like you know, different uh, sounds in his um, in his music and shit. Uh, go from like you know jazz to rock, uh, 
uh, sometimes they go at you straight up, but uh, you know. I don't know. I feel like it's it varies a lot. I don't know. So I'm not even sure about who like prevail more. I don't know. I feel like J Cole makes like more classical music in a way, or, or something around that, something around that, uh, something around that like nature. So I I, I honestly don't know. Uh, what's going on, Quiet? How you doing? Bro? It's hard to say. I don't really know who prevail more. Cause I feel like Kendrick Lamar. I feel like he's more for like. I feel like anybody can bump some Kendrick Lamar. Bump some Kendrick Lamar music. You know what I mean? But in the, I mean, but I feel like you know, in the present time, like present day and age, I feel like Kendrick Lamar's music is obviously going to be played a lot more because you know. I feel like nowadays niggas try to like, you know, undermine J. Cole and say he's like boring or something like that. I don't know, which is kind of bullshit. But J. and Cole are on the same level as I, I, I somewhat agree with that to a certain extent, somewhat. It can't be what he's doing in the 90s, that shit gone crazy. Bro, no, that's facts. I gonna lie to you. Look, I'm, I'm saying this right now, bro. If Kendrick dropped to Pippa Butterfly back in the 90s, that would, it would be, that would be on some Illmatic shit. That would be on some Illmatic shit, for real. That would have been literally the biggest album of that decade. I'm telling you right now. It would have been the biggest album of that decade. Magus is literally seen as as one of the, as one of the if not the best hip hop albums of all time. Well, I mean, well, I mean, to a lot of people, to a lot of people, yes. a lot of uh, people. Are like, oh, my God, bro, I'm about to die! Tell these niggas to leave me alone. Oh my god! I'm about to die! Like it. Take this! Like it! Your Majesty! Come on! Time's up! Uh, okay, bitches. Y'all fucking with the bitches, chat? Y'all uh, fucking with the bitches. Good. Good. Focus on money first. Fuck the bitches. Get your money up first. Don't worry about the bitches, chat. They'll come along after this. Now this, okay, this is a real question now. 
Jack, y'all think Drake would prevail back in like, you know, early, like, you know, old age hip hop? Y'all think that like, he would still prevail like how he is now? Or y'all think he's just more like on some pop culture shit? Like, you know, niggas just. Like, niggas just, you know, hear him and like, oh, you know. You know, Drake doing that, uh, you know, pop culture shit. Man. You get flames. You think so? I feel like I, uh, shit. I don't think he, I don't think, oh yeah, honestly, I don't think he get playing. I ain't gonna lie to you. Cause look, back then, most rappers were not with that singing shit, bro. They were not with that singing shit. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I feel like if you were over here singing and shit, niggas be like, what the fuck is nigga? How is nigga doing? Is he gay? You know what I mean? I feel like niggas probably be asking that. Like, I don't know. It, like, I guess back in the 90s, it was snow. Harmonically, that shit makes me crazy when this one has to be on his ass. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. My girl, we type it down. Y'all remember, bro, y'all remember when, um, 
Yeah, I don't know, Kendrick Lamar literally declared war on every single rapper in the game, or every rapper in his generation. Your Majesty, come on! Time to that nigga name dropped every single nigga in the game. He didn't get no fuck. I missed that kid. I mean, that nigga like that kid is like that. That fire. Darkness. I think Ken said, "I'm moving the shits, bro." Yeah. Fuck your top five, nigga. I made sure, man. Sure, all your four fans never hurt y'all niggas. They want to hear a 9 9 or a birth of you, nigga. Yeah. You're crazy. Here's a little punch in the shit. Wait, what? Yeah. Wait, what? Jokes aside, all, right, all jokes aside, all jokes aside, Kendrick gotta like actually drop some shit to say like, you know, I mean, he's just welcome to the top five, bro. I mean, he is, but I, I gotta hear, I, I, need, I need some new music, bro. I'm tired of waiting. I don't have, I don't have much time left in my life. I, I need new music and I need to know. Holy shit, it's been damn near five years since you dropped an album. Why wait so late, bro? Why wait so late? Why, Kendrick? Why are you gonna do this to your fans, man? Come on. We're hungry. We gotta eat. You don't have, you have much lot time in your life left after that heart. I'll be fine. Despite that shit nearly taking my life away. I mean, look, I mean, look, this is, this is Kendrick's, Kendrick said he is, this is his last album with TV. So, I mean, obviously I expect this to be like, you know, a, a well-weighted, like, you know, work the weight album or some shit. Hey, look, what the fuck do you need, buddy? Get off my chair. Ah, 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 no. Get off. Yeah. Why are you on me? Get off! What is me, bro? Why are you up? Yeah. Top five is Ronnie. Right. Alright, seriously, they look good. Runkai met Gideon at Lowe's. Is, is it top of the morning? Not really, no. Okay, can you get off, please? Uh. Um, Take this. But yeah, just know when Kendrick drops, fine drops his album though. That shit's doing like number numbers. That shit's doing number numbers for real. You feel me? All I hope is that when he drops it, it's not like I mean, look, Kendrick's never disappointed before. He, I mean, he's never been disappointed before. So I, I have high high expectations, but I just hope that we drop it. It's not like some like you know. I should make some bad shit. Huh. 
Oh no, for real. It's gonna be a it's gonna be a crazy night when that shit drops. Your Majesty! Come on! It is on the red line, bro. The candy drops, the world stops. Not even dicks up for percent It's true. Take this! Kind of crazy. He's like, he's one of those like, underrated like, 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 most of them don't know about Like it! Juice is good, but not at, not at stab people for the moment at all. I feel like I feel, okay. Look, I feel like most niggas. Uh, look, let, let's be hundred percent here. I'm not even trying to be like you know. I ain't trying to stop. I fuck with Juice World too. Juice World is fire. Like, but I feel like a lot of niggas put him on a higher pedestal way after he died. You know what I mean? I feel like niggas put him on a higher pedestal. Like, yeah. You know what I mean? He's talented as fuck. He is talented. Yeah, some niggas are just like me. Yeah, like it. So the first thing that works here, boom. Thank you, Halo. Darkness. Yeah. All songs have all songs sound the same. Uh, well, no, they don't really. Why do I have to that shit off? Yeah, that's what I was Nah, okay, look. I don't, look, I don't really know. All Juice World songs do not sound the same. Okay? They do not sound the same. They should follow the same, like, tone, but they're not all, they don't all sound the same. Not even close. I mean, come on, like, I don't really, I mean, look, look at it this way, though, a lot of, look, a lot of these new age rappers, though, they basically do the same exact thing, but not with depression and shit, they just rap about sex, money, drugs, all that shit, and niggas eat it up all the time, so, I mean, it's like, what's the, like, like what, like, why, why is such a problem when, you know, we're just rapping about, like, uh, one major topic, I don't, I don't see, I don't see a problem with it, really, no, I mean, it's just, it's just what he raps about, that's just, like, his nature, so Probably so underrated. My way was. Yeah. I feel like he's better on features. Anything, anything above that is like. Eh. 
Although, he does make some pretty good music, too. Well, eh. Yeah, yeah, he has a couple good songs. A couple good songs, as far as I heard. You know what I mean? The last, last album I heard from him wasn't really it for me, though. Everything sounded the same. I walked you literally before I got on stream. Why are you shitting in the room? You fucking idiot. Oh my god, Smokes. Oh my god. I walked this nigga before I got on and he took two shits. Why is he shitting again in the room? What is wrong with this nigga's bowels, bro? Bro. I legit walked him before I streamed. What sense does that make? talking about now we're talking about while I was going to clean up shit But okay, there were some songs that were just complete ass, but there are other songs that are actually pretty good. I can lie to you, you know what I mean? Don't get it twisted. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit. There are songs like. Yeah. Let me have some pretty good rock songs there. You know what I mean? Y'all remember that song Knockout with Dick Minaj? That song was pretty good. You can get a knockout. It's not like a complete white nut, it's not like some. Like, you know, some suburban kids shit, but it was crazy. Look at that. Just never make you turn up turn up and like like and look at me and dozens and dozens of other songs. That's not true! That is definitely not true. That is not true at all. There are, okay, look, there are, look, there are some Juice WRLD songs that are actually good that don't involve, like, fucking depressing and shit, bro. There are definitely some songs, yes, that doesn't involve depression. Or you, or you can still, like, get turned to it and shit. Um, Dangerous, yeah. Um, there's other song called... And it, that, that's 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 young boy song, but it's no, nah. bro. What was that song? What was that song called? It's called Ten Something. What was it called? Oh my god! Why the fuck do I keep forgetting songs? Y'all 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 should know what it is. It's called Ten or Something. Next is Master of Trail Music. Mm. Honestly, I'm master at it. X definitely had like some good turn-up songs though, for real. I don't think he was a master at it though. And maybe like and, and when we first started out, I'll be sure he had the he had this he had the shit, but I don't know. Oh yes, daddy! Yes, Daddy. Uh, revenge my body on fire, bro. <laughs> as far as I know it, 
Exo, look, Exo Zamper is definitely versatile though. He, 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 was, he was very versatile. Ha, take this. I want that. I want not. Darkness. Okay, I ain't gonna lie to you, look. I wasn't, look, before X died, I mean, even, even, no, no. I was never, I was never really a fan of him, but I didn't wish him like that. Before, before his death, all, all, the only album I heard from him was, uh, was Question Mark. And it wasn't really my vibe. There are a couple good songs on there. I mean, obviously there's Infinity, Sad, Moonlight. But, like, Looking back at it, it's like, I feel like if I listened to the album again, it may be a little bit better. You know what I mean? But, the way I see it, though, it's just like, I don't know. I, I, I could never really get into his music, because I just thought X was kind of... I don't know, I, all I thought was, where I like the word, the name X got brought up, I thought it was on some, like, you know, you know school sniper type of shit, you know, you know, heavy metal, rock demon type of shit. I wasn't really with that, you know, but it wasn't really my vibe. But, I mean, looking back at it now, I mean, you know, looking back at it now, I mean, there's like, some song. I mean, there, I, I know that he's like very versatile because I always remember. Skins his best album in my opinion. Dre, why are you trying? Why are you trying to start? Why are you trying to start like? Why are you trying to start an argument in chat? Why are you trying to start an argument in chat? What are you trying to do, bro? Stop trolling. Stop trolling, please. Like it. Take this. Yeah. Like it. Take this. Yeah. Like it. Take this. The juice will fall off. Take this. I don't know. I mean, yeah, but he, I mean, he had a girlfriend before he died, though. So I don't know. He had a girl before he died. Yeah, like it. Y'all heard Corey's album only sold like 20k per week. I don't, I don't about that. Your Majesty. How y'all really feel about that? That's actually kind of crazy. 20k first week is actually kind of crazy. Are you sleeping? I, mean, I guess. But then again, it's a it's a different era, and most niggas don't care about like actual skill in hip hop. So. Yeah. I mean. Take oh, this! Your Majesty! Ah! Time's up! Yeah! Darkness! Probably one of the best artists in the Yeah! I thought he's one of the, like, one of the most, like, one of the most skillful artists in the Definitely up there in terms of skill, but I don't know. I feel like I feel like he's too he's too underrated. I don't know. Like it. X and Corey all mid. Okay, <laughs> yo, slow down, <laughs> slow down. <laughs> 
out of all that now. Out of all that now. into like the whole like you know singing and rapping like you know mix like on their songs and shit like that like they try to like, harmonize and all that shit I feel like it's getting kind of like outplayed or something you know what I mean it's getting a little bit outplayed somebody in the game has to like do like change the game a little bit cause I'll be damn right here just singing and rapping shit all the time bro it's gonna be a point I don't I don't feel like this is music no more yeah. that shit In terms of what? In terms of what, though? I mean, sure, little baby, you know, he has, you know, maybe, maybe like, like, like song making and shit. Oh, well, actually, I don't know about song making. Well, that, that depends. They, they both have two different vibes, so I don't know about that. That's kind of, like, it's kind of saying a little bit over, over there. Take this. must age about how long it lasted. Like it. Sort of. Yeah. Ah, take this. Your Majesty. Come ah, on. Time's up. Okay, young boy. Young boy. What? Don't start, bro. Don't start, with young boy. Please. I, okay. Look. I, oh, look. Nine on some hating shit. I feel like a young boy is the dick sucking rapper of the generation. This thing could literally fart into a mic and niggas will enjoy it. I swear, I shit you not. He could fart into a mic and drop it and niggas will literally fucking it. Holy shit. Holy shit. Young boy better Ride the fuck out of young boy, bro. I mean, sure. Look, once, look, once upon a time, I used to think that young boy was complete trash. He couldn't drop any moves. I mean, right now, I don't think that anymore. I mean, he's not like trash. He's just kind of weird to me. I, mean, I feel like a lot of songs he drops sound literally exactly the same or very, very similar. You know what I mean? A lot of his songs sound extremely similar, bro. I got a lot of niggas that said, oh, the baby song makes the same music. Uh, it's shook part 36. Like, well, nigga, young boy is the same as that thing. Literally, young boy has two different types of songs, bro. He's either singing or he's either, he's either rapping on a very, like, uh, hard, on a hard, uh, like, track beat or some shit. It's only two different like songs he has. But, you know. Take this. What can you say? 
moves, huh? Yeah, and all of them, and more than half of them sound the same. It's not true, it is true, though. Like it. Oh, Jesus, I'm going X either, by the way. I agree. Oh, G falling off, bro. <laughs> that nigga, I mean, I ain't gonna lie, some, like, some of his newer shit has been a little bit different, so I fuck with that, but. Outside of that, I don't know, man. He ain't really hit the same like he used to. That's just me. What would you think of that nigga out here? That nigga lets the fucking pianos carry him, bro. Let the pianos carry. Like speed running, so like, used to better on this on this on uh, the other way. Star Rocket? Actually, it's good, Naya. How you doing? You good. Nah, it's crazy. It, look, if you already had like a okay, look, if you already had like a good name in hip hop or something like that, like niggas who already knew who you were at some point, and you die. Oh, the numbers they they skyrocket like shit. They they just they jump like that. You know what I mean? But, uh... I don't know what I'm but yeah, I don't know. Sai got one billion, yeah. Sai got, like, at one point, Sai legit broke the record for, like, streams after I just died. His new music was absolutely but then we're talking artists to me because how good an old shit was, that's just how, how it is. Maybe young boy now is good right now, but I was only coming up on like that song. I think it's just better. Maybe his old shit is better. For all, for what I mean, I don't know. I don't know how it's been better, but it's better. But yeah, it's true. The way I see it though, I, I just, yeah, I'm not really 
I I don't know. I'm not young with that. Can't really use it. I can't really use it. Well, I mean, I, I mean, not all of them. I mean, that's it. He had a couple songs I already using. A couple good songs. At the end of the day, though, like... <laughs> yeah, bro. Oh, no. Like it! So, okay, so young boy fans, let me see where y'all's mind really is, though. Who, who's a better, who's a better artist up in the world? Kodak or um, young boy? Who's a better artist overall? I take it you're Riku. Are you with Ansem? You are half correct. Let us say that he is not the Ansem with which you are familiar. What? He is Ansem, and he is not Ansem. Perhaps a nobody best conveys the idea. Young boy is better than Kodak. Thing. Try again. He belongs to neither the light nor the dark, but I'm walks the twilight me. between. Oh. <laughs> Catching on now? Oh yes. You also stand in between the light and the darkness. It appears we have much in common. Maybe. Like you said, there really is darkness left inside of me. But so what? Darkness is my enemy. And so are you for reeking of that awful smell. Oh, so it's a fight you want. Very good. I shall take you on. God, I hate fighting this nigga, bro. So many guys. Finish him, bro. Speaking of Bruno Mars, Bruno Mars, Bruno Mars got that shit for sure. So, bro, so songs not most fire. I thought like it needed, it don't need more songs, but it was still good. Out. Take 
Take this! Darkness! I don't listen to that nigga. I don't listen to Bruno Mars like I like that. I, like, I don't listen to him. But, I mean, you can't knock the fact that that nigga's hella talented. That nigga's for real. That nigga's talented for sure. Like shit. Do you suppose Malone? Uh. Juice World or Post Malone? I mean, I. I personally fuck with Juice World more than Post Malone. I don't listen to Post Malone like that. If you're asking who's like a better artist, uh. It's hard to say, I don't know. But I guess, yeah, probably Juice, I'm guessing. I don't know. Stuck in the car, had to listen to 13 hours of, of. I mean, okay, if you're in a car with your homeboys or some shit, and, I mean, I play, I probably play the weekend or some shit. We can have, I feel like we can have more breast top used to play with, like, you know, like with your boys or some shit, but like, it depends, bro. Like, okay, look, Bruno Mars is like, is more like a, of a love song maker than the weekend is, in my opinion. You feel me? 
Bro, it's more, more like a love song, nigga. I feel like you're in the car with your girl. Oh, I'm blasting the fuck out of Bruno in the car with my girl. But, yeah, this was your boy, isn't it? Even. Please. 
said a little Wayne. Nigga, Lil Wayne? What kind of question is that? Is that really a, is that really a question? Take uh, fifty better than the way. Okay, you know what? Real, just stop it. 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 Not even close. Not even close. Not even fucking close. <laughs> I find coursing through you there is a darkness of formidable power growing, well worth the trouble of aggravating you. All this excitement has provided me with invaluable data. What? <laughs> Many thanks, Riku. It was a trick all along. As long as you got you know, the same question as before, you get a car, you listen to 12 hours of weight or 50. HELL YES! What the fuck? HELL YES! What the? Boy, I can play a whole al Bro, I can play a whole album. Multiple albums of, of, uh, of Lil Wayne before I can play like, you know, like, come on now. Really? Did you really just ask me that? You know how many I can play for Lil Wayne, just like back to back to back before I can like just you know play like I can play like one maybe like one fifty cent album like you know his probably his best album as far as that goes. But like you think you are you like actually dead ass? Are you dead ass? You saying fifty cent, bro? If the only album you're probably listening for two for fifty cent is like Get Rich or Die Trying, that's probably the only album, the only album you're probably listening to, and in, in the car. That's about it. That's really about it. Outside of that, like, really? Like, no. Just no. No, no. Just no. Ox Battle about this? It's going to be a sweep! It, but it's, there's really no point in me doing that. It's going to be a legit sweep. No way, whole album is good. Really no got hits. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop talking. Stop talking. Just stop talking. Please. Just stop talking. Oh my god. Oh my god. Just, just, no, just stop. Just stop. I thought, and I thought, look, and I thought Dre had horrible takes. I thought Dre had horrible takes for music. 
Oh my god, I, I was wrong. I was wrong. Oh my god. <laughs> I never heard some shit like that in my life. So, we're not just- no, 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 no. No, we're not- no, we're not- no, we're not just 50 or anything. It's just like, bro, like, really? How many hit- look, look, look. How many albums- like, how many hit albums fucking 50 said have to bring? Look, aside from the hits. Aside from the hits. Like, are you dead ass? Are you dead ass? I could give look, I could give you several albums. Several albums from from Lil Wayne. All of them hit the same. I could I could look I could repeat them all. All of the songs, most of the German songs, like look at look word, bro. Look here. Carter 4, Carter 3, you know, Car you know, there's Carter 2 guy. Got some, you know, got some things on there too. Uh what was it? I'm not a human being one, I'm not a human being two. Uh what else? I look, I, I look, not I look, not I look, outside the, even the, the mixtapes, the mixtapes, oh, outside the mixtapes, oh, y'all ain't ready for that shit, y'all ain't ready for this. Shit. the drought, motherfucking, sorry for the wait, oh my god, nah, bro, <laughs> what, 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 what is, what, 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 okay, look, what does 50 Cent have, bro, what, what 50 Cent have, bro, for real, like, what, what, what does 50 Cent have other than, like, you know, get rich guys, bro, what else he got on him? Cause I named my bunch of those albums there. I don't think I don't think he gonna do all those albums I just made. I'm just saying. This is like songs too. Yeah, what was the last time Fifty made an album, made a song or an album? That was that didn't include like Pop Smoke after like his death. R.I.P. Puzzles, who is it? Fireman, get money, or got money, fucking, bro, I'll, bro, I'll name every single song on the Carter 4 if you want, I'll name every song on the Carter 4, bro, I know all of them, I know all of them, you dig, motherfucking blunt blowing, abortion, uh, President Carter, motherfucking, uh, Oh, oh, um, it's good. Motherfucking how to love, how to hate. Motherfucking uh, uh, so special, bro. Like, come on now, bro. I can go on and on for days. I can go on and on for days. She will. Oh my god. No, no. It's been the same guy. He fits in. Got it for real. He ain't got it for real. Him. He ain't got it for real on him. And my you, all the songs I talked about, they're not even like, you know, on like hip shit. Well, I mean, they're all, I mean, they are hip shit. So, like, they're not like, you know, I ain't hearing them, I ain't hearing them shit on the radio. I don't like the radio. So, yeah. No. It's game over. That's all I'm on. I would, but it's probably my goal on this Your Majesty, come on! This is Officer. Oh my God, nigga, six foot. Se oh my God. No, 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 no. I don't really know, bro. I want you to tell me what song. Does 50 Cent have outside? No, outside of like any outside of any song on Get Rich, Get Rich or Die Trying. What song does 50 Cent have that's going to match six foot seven foot? Hmm. What song does he have that's going to match six foot seven foot? Huh? What? What you got it? What you got? Huh? What you got that's going to compare with that? Nothing. <laughs> Take this. That was some. Uh, that was some of Lil Wayne's best work. A milli, a milli. Which y'all got that can go against a milli? Candy shop, fuck no. Come on. Get a 
on my mind. Snaggle to a snitch. Not nah, rusty. Not nah, rusty. <laughs> Not nah, rusty. Nah. And look, I'm telling you right now, you can have a verse between Lil Wayne and 50, bro. 50 is getting washed. He is getting washed. No competition. No competition at all. Probably got like, you know. Probably got like, you know. Five, like, probably four or five songs for 50. And that's about it. That's about it. But he's not like. Oh yeah. I feel like Kanye has well, I mean it, it might be very close now I think about it. It could be kinda close. I don't know how it is, but I think Kanye might not even do it. Could be close. Guns come out, hustlers ambition, keep your eyes on yours, proficient at power, still well shot down. I'm supposed to die at night. You know, none of those songs are going to match Lil Wayne's discography. They will not match his discography. It don't match. It do not matter, bro. It will not match his discography. Darkness! Like, you're on your own here. I don't know what to tell you. You're on your own here. Yeah, but I don't see his best songs. Bro, <laughs> it just stop. <laughs> it just stop. It just stop. It just stop. It just stop. Uh, I'm not. I, I don't even argue this. It's just ridiculous. <laughs> Kanye not better than Wayne. So Kanye's not better than Wayne, but you think that 50 Cent is better than Wayne. But make it make sense. Your opinion, though. The average person is not listening to Lil Wayne over 50 Cent. Uh, I'm telling you straight up. The average person is not picking 50 Cent over Lil Wayne. I put that. I put money on it. The average person is definitely not. Maybe you could. Maybe you are, but not the average person. Darkness. Alright, uh, 
was gonna step. Right. my stream and I'm not doing a game for this or whatever. I see exactly what it is y'all talking about like with the soldier lobby. I need to create a mind respect it myself. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I feel like after Kanye and like uh and Kim Kardashian broke up, I feel like Kanye got better with the music. Not even gonna cap to you. But look, back when Kanye dropped like, you know, albums like uh Like Yay, I not I not enjoy Lucy Yay. Yay was really my vibe. Kissy Kissy goes to the ground. That one gospel album he dropped or some shit. That, that shit was not it for me, bro. That shit was not it. That shit was yeah. not it. For me. ARs that can make it sound like real things than others, bro. Gospel album? Count, you can't count as a, as a gospel album? Oh, uh, uh. oh. You know, don't design a gospel album. Out of all artists, I feel like Kanye has had the most faces out of any artist. He be going through so many mood swings and changes, bro. It is pretty crazy. You know what I mean? That's just me. One minute, you know, he goes to like a, you know, a, the blonde hair phase. Then he goes to the Trump phase. Then he goes through the, you know, the uh, religion, God, you know, God phase and shit. You know, Like it. Anyway, some heartbreaks, yeah. You can go through a lot of phases. Your Majesty! Come on! Time's up! Take a whiskey for a scoop dog. Dog? I mean, I don't know. It all depends. I mean, okay, look. I mean, okay, obviously in today's day and age, people don't really listen to them as much anymore. Whiskey has some hits, but Stoop Dog got some crazy ass hits too, though, bro. But also, got yeah. mine, it's a different age. So. But some songs that Stoop Dog made are timeless. Like Gin and Juice, uh, Drop the light is hot. Sensual seduction. Yeah. Fucking, uh, even with Dr. Dre, I mean, you know, he's uh, it's fucking uh, next episode. Uh, still Dre. You know, things of that nature, so I don't know. 
It's a lot of things on this, on this discovery. Take this. On the other hand, I mean, which group that has black and yellow, I roll up, uh, I'm on my level. Huh. Is that it? Take this! Huh. 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 What's up? Darkness! Uh, even with even with the whole like you know, remember the fast fire out and shit. You know we own it. I don't know. There's a lot of songs. There's a lot of songs. Let's just talk about Wiz and Day to leave. I'm gonna Wiz too. That's already on the script. Yeah, I don't know. Niggas don't talk about Wiz sleeping no more, though, bro. He, like... I don't know what happens, but, like... You don't... I mean, he's like, he's, he's still making music. But, like, niggas don't really be, like, talking about Wiz like that no more, bro. He, like... Take this. Like, you know what I mean? I just don't know what he is. It's like after, like, um, you know... I feel like after him and uh Emma Rose yeah. broke up, it was like, like it. I think he's gonna talk about Wiz Keeper as much as he was. That was a very good thing about this. Uh, that was a uh, go to that one. Even though I'm not a pothead, still go to that one. So it's not Cole's best album. Drain. Why do you always have these horrible takes? So what what is his best album in your opinion? Then? What is his best album? Cold World 2. Drive has so many like iconic ass songs, bro. So many iconic songs. The whole album is iconic. I mean, Cold World 2 is, I mean, is sort of iconic in a way, too, but nah. Forest Hill Drive was literally like J. Cole's biggest album for a reason. The only songs you can probably recall are Workout, Can't Get Enough, Dollar in a Dream 3, Sideline Story, and The Morning. That, that's literally it, bro. Them songs are not fucking with. Tale of Two Cities, Wet Dreams, Ro No Role Models, January 28th, 03 Adolescence, so on and so forth, Love Yours, this is the best song, is it now, is it now, I think that was his game, 